We always think about others like, wow, he is very lucky. She doesn't even have a single worry in her life. In this way, we always think, right? But it is absolutely wrong. Because everyone has an equal opportunity which we call as luck. We only have to invite our luck into our life by doing good deeds and with our best thoughts. Even we have to keep one thing in our mind that is everything is in our hands only. It is somewhat difficult to have luck in our life easily because if you want luck in our life there should be some work need to be done by us. Yes, it is true. Everyone wants to lead their happy life without any hurdles. They are said to be lucky. So, what is the thing which happens in our life which needs to be created by us only? In order to know more about luck, initially we will see one fine example. There is a man who studied well and got a good job. Because of the good job, he was well settled and even got a good wife and beautiful children. Everyone said, what a happy life and how lucky he is. He is the man who initially got a seat in a good college. If he thinks I am very lucky that I will get good marks even without any preparation for exam, then what will happen? He will definitely fail. So he studied well and got good marks. Later, because of his good marks, he won't get any kind of job because marks without skills doesn't bring any job. So he acquired good skills which helps to get a good job. Till now it's okay. Because of his good job, he might get good marriage proposals. But for this he definitely needs a lot of knowledge about family and organizing in order to live a good life, right? So from schooling to becoming a good man, he has to overcome different stages with different skills and hard work which others call as pure luck. But this example we can say luck doesn't mean what comes in free. but. It is the mixture of three things which are said to be hard work, talent and chances. We know that we can control both hard work and talent but chances we can't control. So now we will learn how to increase our chances. We can control our luck. Yes, we can control our luck. Because as per the example we have seen before, we can design our luck. But for that, we have to prepare one plan. Yes, in order to do any kind of work, in order to step forward, we need an idea along with hard work and talent. Because luck is a mixture of three things. We have to always search for our chances so that whatever the work we will start definitely happens with a great output and even how to make sure whether we have all the skills in order to complete our particular work. If we put whatever the inputs we can able to, then definitely get output more than our expectation, which is said to be luck welcome towards us. Luck always seems to be against the man who depends on it. How to increase our chances? As we know we can't control our chances, but whatever we get a chance, we should not even think about losing it. So before expecting any kind of chance, we need to do all kinds of work as the inputs for our particular work. And even we have to clear about one thing that chances will not search for us. And even we should be that much of persistence in order to achieve good chances. For example, we need a good work from home job. But 
just wishing will not fulfill our dreams right but we have to do background work in order to develop our skills with persistence by applying different kinds of job which are relevant to our skills then we will definitely get our expected job we have to come out of our comfort zone in order to get better chances even one thing we have to keep in mind is just one trial is not enough for thomas alva edison to achieve the invention of the bulb before the invention of the bulb he made different trials in different ways with passion and persistence in order to get the chance of success so we need to increase our trial in order to get more chances clearly we can say how to create our chances in order to get success which is other calls as luck every new day is the second chance to change our life tips for luck we often think that everyone thinks in the same manner but why does luck comes for only for few now we will see in detail widen your network of acquaintances here is a good tip to widen our network in order to get more chances in some situations most of us will get help from unknown people yes it is true even many of us experience this because we don't know everyone's talent even we can't predict so to get more chances in order to get our work done we need to widen our network with new people so that unknowingly will get luck from an unknown person strange but it is true diversify your life most of us no no everyone in this world wants to lead a beautiful life right in order to get good life definitely needs more money for the people in the way of the journey towards the biggest goal need more than their earnings for getting more chances those chances will bring us better output so diversify our life in doing different kinds of businesses and jobs and to get better chances yes it will work out how to avoid bad luck till now we discussed about luck which is mixture of hard work talent and chances combination of these three is said to be pure luck if we hard work with good talent and to grab good chances then we won't call as unlucky if we won't follow these three things we will see the loss in our life definitely but we have to change things into luck with our thinking here is the best example how we can change our life with our thinking to get good chance there is a king who is ruling the kingdom once call his ministers and said he is offering 10 lakhs for each ministers all are very happy because of king's mercy but when ministers leaving the king's chamber full of money in their hands king called them back and said one rule in order to spend their whole money king kept the rules that before spending the money each and every one should see the king's face even they have to spend the whole money within 3 months only if they won't spend the money within the period they have to repay the money then ministers felt somewhat nervous and left the chamber later from day 1 till 3 months king didn't came from his chamber so ministers came back in order to repay the whole amount but except one minister then king said how dare you spend the whole money without seeing my face you crossed the rule so definitely you have to repay the whole money then the minister replied wisely 
No, my dear king. Every day before spending the money, I used to see your face, which was there in every note. By hearing this, everyone shocked. From this story, we can observe that everyone has plenty of chances, but if you won't have the talent to utilize those, then it will be pure unluck. So work hard with talent to grab better chances.